Few people in New Haven were also enjoying the sun and finding ways to stay cool at Lighthouse Point Park. Fox 61's Gabby Molina has more on the hot summer Sunday. Making sure to pack all the essentials. We got the yep. sunscreen, we got the tent, we got the chairs, Hi. you name it. A lot of stuff in here. Folks headed to Lighthouse Point Park in New Haven, finding different ways to beat the heat. Because one thing was for sure, it was hot. We decided to kind of get out here early just to make sure we get in. We knew it was going to be a scorcher today. It's really hot, but you know what, to be honest, there is a breeze. For most people, taking a dip in the water was the key to staying cool. Well, at first it was cold, but once you throw yourself in, it's not as cold. You just, you know, got to swim in, you know, because I was hot. We're, we're just swimming like... in the ocean and we're going to play. I like to do in the water, it's beautiful in the water. Others found the shade, like the Ellison family from Manchester, Hi. who was picnicking at the park. The whole, the whole family. We got the whole crew. The whole family. Yep. Our first time here. Um, it's, it's beautiful. It's, and even during a day of fun, everyone still had safety in mind. We have to social distance. We have and, our hand sanitizer and masks. masks. We're keeping distance, which is very, very important. We have to be so, definitely yeah. social distancing. Usually the park has a limit of 100 cars, but expanded it to 300 this weekend because of the heat wave. Nearly a dozen state parks around the state, like Rocky Neck and East Lyme, Miller's Pond in Haddam, and Silver Sands in Milford were at capacity by noon. Lighthouse Point Park is open on Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. In New Haven, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.